Let's review how the OPW71SO overfill prevention valve operates. The installer would determine the primary or the final shutoff location in accordance with the local authority having jurisdiction, or AHJ, by utilizing our installation guide or the OPW product guide app. Most trailers can drop almost 400 gallons per minute. As the fuel level rises to the point that it lifts the float arm near the horizontal position, the overfill prevention valve will move to the primary shutoff position and the driver's drop hose will jump noticeably. While the valve is in this primary shutoff position, the fuel flowing down the drop tube is severely limited to as little as 3 to 5 gallons per minute. This allows the driver more than ample time, often more than 30 minutes, to shut off the flow while the remainder of the fuel in the drop hose drains into the tank as per the EPA regulations. If, however, the driver fails to stop the flow from the trailer, the trickle of fuel being dropped stops completely when the tank has reached the final shutoff position. This prevents the top of the inside of the tank from ever being wetted, another EPA regulation. When the float has reached the final shutoff position, the only way to drop more fuel into the tank is if the fuel is being pumped into vehicles, draining the level down to that below the AHJ's percentage of tank capacity.